The way out of Mostar was across a littered no-man's land. Muslims and Croats have been battling it out here for four months. We escorted five badly wounded children being evacuated by a private relief worker from Britain. Among them, 10-year-old Selma, covered in shrapnel wounds. She had lost an arm, she could lose an eye. Yet these children were the lucky ones to escape from the hell on earth which is Mostar. Trapped behind about 30,000 people and trapped with them too the UN relief convoy which Wednesday wound its way through tough terrain to bring in the first food and medicine for months. The convoy blockaded by a desperate people and a Muslim army which is losing the war on all fronts.